Hi, Off the Trails is here at Payne's Prairie Preserve in Micanopy, about 10 miles south of Gainesville. Payne's Prairie offers a lot of different outdoor activities. We're back on the Great Birding Trail. There's also camping, picnicking, hiking, boating, no swimming. There's a visitor center, which we're going to look at right now. Hope you're going to enjoy this trip. Come along with us. We're here in the visitor center, and these are some of the animals that you might be lucky to see visit the park. This is a bobcat. There are bison. A bald eagle. And of course, the alligators. Native Americans were in this area 7,000 years ago. And these are some of the artifacts that were discovered in this area. They were the Alachua Indians, and this is Alachua County. Now those aren't the only animal you might see here. There's also horses, cattle, deer, a variety of snakes, birds, reptiles and amphibians, and of course, many different types of insects. It's a veritable treasure house of wildlife. Maybe we'll see something. Payne's Prairie is very diverse ecologically, from forest to the swamps to the grasses. Now, what's a prairie? A prairie is a vast piece of land that is relatively flat and with very few trees or shrubs. Payne's Prairie got its name from one of the local Indian chiefs. Now, we're about to climb up to the observation deck here to the tower and take a look around. You coming? William Bartram was the first white naturalist to come into this area back in 1774, and this is what he first saw when he got here. Here's a view from the second level. Here we are at the top of the observation deck. Some very nice colors and textures there. We're here on the Jackson's Gap hiking trail. Here we have some holly plants growing. Okay, we've come to some signs and it says Jackson's Gap is off to our right, so that's where we're going to head. Here's a natural sculpture. A fallen log with some fungus or fungi, since there's so many. Now well, here's a old homestead. It's totally collapsed. I would suspect it's providing a home for some different types of animals. Mice, rats, snakes, ants. There's the chimney. It's cool to think of what might be living in there. Here's an old fence post. Still got some of the fence on it. This is very curious. It doesn't appear to be any breeze at the moment. Nothing else is moving, but this is fanning back and forth. Always keeping an eye up. And one down. More of nature's sculpture. Some nice color here. Yeah, looking up, we spotted a few nests. There's one. And right above me is another. Here's the lake. Boating or fishing, but no swimming because there are alligators. There's 
some birds for the bird watchers. There's a boater. We just heard a gator over there. Don't see him though. And another boater. Adjacent to the boat ramp is the picnic area with several shelters. And there's a playground area. There's a space for the kids and a horseshoe court for the adults. Here's that beautiful prairie. This is Payne's Prairie. A good panoramic view of it. Payne's Prairie is just the first stop on our exploration of North Central Florida. We didn't see any animals today and we're disappointed, but maybe we'll have better luck on the next part of the trip, the next adventure. Hope you'll join us.